everyone i'm harry welcome to my channel today we're going to do another cover and how to sound like video this time we're going to try and get the tones on dance little liar by the arts monkeys 
So before we get started, if you like this covering sound like video at any point, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and hit the little bell notification for me as well. It really does help me out a lot, and that way you want me sign in my future uploads. There's going to be affiliate links down in the description to every piece of gear I used in this video and to record my videos. These do help support the channel out further, so I'd really appreciate it if you go and check them out. So the reason why I decided to do this is because I was recently sent in demo the brand new Halo Andy Timmons signature delay pedal from Keeley Electronics. They captures his famous Halo delay time as well as giving you loads of different delay times as well and I thought it'd be killer for this. This song has one of my favorite uses of delay. It has kind of like a slap back but with loads of repeats for that main riff. If you want to see my full demo of the Halo by Keely Electronics there'll be a link up in the cards in the description and pinned in the comments. Okay so we'll look at Alex's parts first. So I'm using my 1965 reissue Jazzmaster because he was using the Jazzmaster around the Humbug time and I'm running into my Victory Copper Deluxe to give us that Voxel amp time that they use a lot around this time. So there's a little bit of drive as well. I'm using the Groove Amps light speed for that and then the other two ingredients are the delay pedal which is the Halo and then a pedal. So basically what you've got for Alex's main riff is kind of like a short stab. And you're doing that all with the sweep of the wah. So when you stab, you kind of go into the toe down position really quick so it's bright. And then the delay is giving you that quick, fast repeat with a lot of repeats as well. Now on the studio recording, it sounds like he played as one track and then he overdubbed the stabs to get even more repeats of the and then do, 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 do. so I did that for the intro song as well. You could do it live with just the mix a bit higher so you can get that fast repeat time coming through a little bit more. And that's pretty much it. So there's reverb coming from the amp as well. And we have that time throughout the whole thing apart from the break where we go. And on that part, I'm just kicking off the wah and the delay pedal. So I'll pull that track isolated from the intro song now so you can see and hear exactly what's going on. You'll see the settings of the Halo on screen. Just bearing in mind we had some reverb from the amp overdrive from the light speed and the wild time is coming from my custom audio electronics MC404 wah. So that track isolated from the intro song sounds like this. <laughs> Okay, so now we have some of Jamie's parts that are basically just cores and then some lead lines for the outro. So I was using my ES335 with Monty's Low Output PF Humbuck and Pickups for that. And all it was was the 335 into the lights being straight into the amp. So we have the cores that come in and then there's the little break where it's like. So it's exactly the same time and the. Really simple, so I'll pull that track isolated from the intro song now. There's no delay on this, so it's just the light speed straight into the amp.
So there we have it. That was the cover and how to sound like video of the Dance Little Liar by the Arts Monkeys. Again, one of my favorite uses of delays and using it in kind of an unconventional way. You've got a slap back with voice and repeats. And of course, having the Halo by Keely Electronics really came in handy for this and really nailed it. There's so much more you can do with this delay pedal. And if you want to see my full demo, there'll be a link up in the cards in the description and pinned in the comments. Of course, having my Jazz Master in 335 for Alex and Jamie's parts really came in handy. The light speed for a bit of drive, the wah, and then the Victory Copper Deluxe for the Vox Amp style tone and a bit of sprint reverb. But let me know down in the comments how close you thought I got to the original song and any future had sound like videos you'd like to see me do. Again, there's going to be affiliate links down in the description to every piece of gear I used in this video and to record my videos. These do help support the channel out further, so I'd really appreciate it going check them out. If you did like this cover and sound like video, please leave a like, comment and subscribe and hit the little bell notification for me as well. It really does help me out a lot and that way you won't be sounding in my future uploads. Other than that, go onto my channel, check out some of my playlists. I have plenty more lessons, covers, gear demos, how to sound like videos and anything guitar related. As always, I've been Harry and thanks for watching.